Hey yo, what's good YouTube? This is K A O Sierra. Just making another quick video, just about, I guess, me and Job Core again. Um, first and foremost, I want to say, once again, thank you, Job Core. Did me a, a a favor, you know, got this job. Security, security. Yeah, I'm a security officer. See my badge. That's my badge right there. But um, yeah, um. I know the last video that I made about Job Corps, y'all really couldn't understand me, so I'm finna just recap a little bit about what I said. Basically, I was saying that, um, hold up one minute. Basically, I was saying that Cardi Perkins was, was a good a good Job Corps. I mean, of course, at any Job Corps, you're gonna have your little ups and downs, your little drama and everything, but as long as you get past that, you'll be alright, you know. Um, a Job Corps is not a bad place. It, I mean, it was a good place to me. I mean, uh, like, it was, it was a life learning experience. Like, like if life had a test, Job Corps would be it. Job Corps is like the that final step before you actually know what you want to be in life. You know, a lot of people want to do certain things in life, but we go Job Corps is like you got it right there. Plus, you're getting a free trade and you're getting paid to go. I mean, that that's 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 good, right? Like, let's see, for instance, um, I didn't, I didn't think I was going to go to Job Corps. Well, I wanted to go to Job Corps since I was, like, 16, and, um, I didn't get to go because I wanted to go ahead and finish high school before, you know, I went because, I mean, that's what they told me. They told me that would be a better thing to do when I called the number or whatever. Um, it was like, when I graduated high school, it was like, you know, try something out. School didn't work, so I was like, Job Corps, call them my name. I'm 19 now, and wait, yeah, I'm 19 now, and I can, you know, do basically what I want to do, so I'm going to go ahead and call this number and try to better my life. So that's what I did. Called, you know, talked to the OA. Actually, the OA was really good friends with um, one of my family members, and um, we talked, and I went to the Job Corps interview, and then uh, the orientation, my bad, and then signed all my paperwork, I got all my papers together, and then um, did the little interview, and then next thing you know, I'll pick up my trades and ready to go. So they called me up August 31st, 2009, that's the day I left. Um, I was originally from Florida, and they had me up there in Kentucky. Uh, I was like, but like, in the long run, it was worth it, you know, I was in Prestonburg, Kentucky, at Cardi Perkins, you know, like that little job core there. I mean, it's like this big, like that big. Like all the other job cores, I believe, were way bigger. But it was okay. I mean, we never went over 300 people, I believe, and it was worth it, you know. Although it was a small campus, you learned a lot. Um, let me see. Um, let's see. Oh, yeah, okay. Got there, we got there on August 31st, that was a Monday, you know, got introduced to all my CPP brothers and sisters, which are the people that come in the same day you do, so basically like a little group, you know, shout out to all of y'all, who are they again, um, Devin, aka Joker, John Cena, Denicia, Kayla, Pudi, Aaron, Sean, Brittany, Robert, Joe, then there was me, um, Shout out to everybody though. I miss y'all, man. I miss y'all a lot. But um, um, yeah, we went. You know, had a little fun there. And you know, a CP group, you stick together for like a little good two, three weeks, whatever. You just stick together because y'all came together and y'all know more about each other. You know, because all these other people are just complete strangers. And it's like, well, might as well stick with them because you know we came in together and we've been spending most of our time together. So you know. You know, you go to breakfast, lunch, and dinner together. You go on trips together and everything, cause you know y'all got that little bond and everything. Yeah, but um, um, let me see, what else? Okay, my trade was security, obviously, cause I'm in security. And that's my job right now. A lot of people job corps don't use their trade, but I decided to use mine. So I'm doing that, and um, also. Um, my instructor, Mr. Wilson, shout outs to you, Mr. Wilson. I will always remember you because you got me where I need to be, Mr. Wilson. You're a great man and 
whoever's taking your class, you know, hey, take it serious, because, I mean, Mr. Mr. Wilson, he'll teach you a lot, you know, he has a lot of experience in everything, for him to be so young, he's got experience in everything, like, anything you need to know, that's Mr. Wilson, he give you the straight up answer, you know, like, he helped me a lot, he helped me realize a lot of things, and, and all, because, like, to be honest, when I first got to Job Corps, I thought it was a joke. I really did. Like, I was like, yeah, right. Whatever, Job Corps. But as I got to stay and, like, you know, really get that opportunity and everything, it's like, maybe Job Corps is something, you know? Um, let's see. Um, what else could I talk about? I'm just going to talk about the living situation. The living situation at Job Corps can be stressful. And I know when most people get there, you know, when you first get somewhere that you're not used to, you get homesick very quickly. I mean, of course, everybody goes through that. and Everybody wants to go home within two, three weeks, maybe in a month or two. But when you stick it out, it's worth it. It's like you're in a room with three complete strangers. So, you know, you got to build that trust bond up. So, you know, you won't be around now. It's hard as like, you know, ooh. Hope they don't take my stuff. You know, you do, I'm not even gonna lie, you do have people that have some like sticky hands, but as long as you do your, as long as you know what you're doing to keep your stuff properly and right and everything, you'll be okay. Um, the food, it's, 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 I, it's, 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 it ain't the best, but I mean, you can eat food for free. It's government food. Eat up. Um. Let's see. We had daily activities. You know, rest schedules. We also went on trips. Um, movies, mall, etc. So you know, whatever they had planned. Um. Um. We had a gym and all that stuff. You know, everybody engaged and all that. You know, you have they have the the sports teams, athletic teams, and everything. And um. They even got a, sorry, my bad job, but, um, they, um, have SGA. SGA was Student Government Association, and fortunately, I got elected to be on, you know, SGA treasurer, and just being on SGA shows responsibility. It shows how many people really, like, are counting on you to do things, you know, and, um, basically what I did as treasurer was the monetary situation, you know, handling budgets and everything and making sure everything goes well. I was also over the food and safety committee, which, you know, food committee, you know, take people, like, handing out surveys, making sure, like, see what people want to eat and what's wrong with the food and all that, you know, all that good jazz. That was my job. And safety was just to make sure, you know, everything was safe and secure at you know, Carly Perkins, which was kind of a good deal because me being secure and learning about safety and maintenance and all that stuff, you know. It's hand in hand, so, um, um, yeah, other than that, you know, it was a great opportunity, you know, being an SGA, it, it showed me a lot of responsibility, and, and it taught me a lot of things, we also went to, you know, places I never went before, like Washington, D.C., went there and had a ball, like, seeing things I never thought I'd see before, it was like a drink untrue, you know, because, I, hell, I would never know when I was going to go there, but I did, and I'm telling you, like, the trade, I mean, Job Corps in general is excellent, I encourage anybody to go, you know, um, keep your head up, you know, make sure everything is great, and, you know, just, just do what you got to do, you don't want to stay there as long, like, forever, like, me only stayed there, like, since, the 31st of August of 09 to March 5th of 010. So I didn't stay there very long because I, you know, I know what I had in mind. I knew what I had to do to get out there and get in the real world and start doing my thing, you know, make real money. So, hey, I did what I do. And here I am today. You know, I'm, su I'm successful. Personally, I believe I'm successful because, I mean, I use my trade. The best trade in the world. Go security. Cardi Perkins. Woo, woo. Yeah, but, um. I, I believe I'm successful and, and nobody can stop me. So don't try. <laughs> but, um, yeah. If you have any questions or anything about.